Hello everyone, this is Hate Strike here from Online Nights, and I'm joined by Robius. Hey guys. And today we're here with a really important update for you guys with some really cool stuff. Take it away, Robius. So, as you guys have seen in our previous update video, we are officially coming back to Halo. And on that note, we've really been wanting to update our whole custom game system for quite some time back in Halo 4. So we thought it'd be a great opportunity with us starting with the map features again to give you guys just an updated system on how you can join our custom games. But before we get into the ways in which you can get involved in our lobbies, there is first of all a really important announcement that we need to make. Since we'd really like to try to get more involved with custom lobbies than we've ever really been before, this is something that myself and Robius can't really do alone, and so we've actually decided to expand our pool of hosts. And so, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, we have two new faces for you to meet today. We have Mnemonic. And on the other side we have Demonic89. And unfortunately he wasn't able to join us today, but we're still going to fill you in on what he's going to be doing. Hi, like you said, my name is Mnemonic and I'll be helping out here at Online Nights by hosting custom games and testing lobbies. I was heavily involved in the Halo 4 community, uh, hosting lobbies, and I'm also a Slayer Forger, so I hope to see all of you at some point in the future. Demonic also has a lot of hosting experience. Uh, he did a lot of uh, Slayer and a lot of Flood back in Halo 4, so he's going to be a great addition to the team as well. And uh, as Demonic said, we're really looking forward to playing with all of you guys. So now that you know who the hosts are going to be, now we'd like to explain how you can get involved with the custom games and start playing with us. Alright, so there are going to be quite a few ways that you can actually get involved into our custom games. Option one, and this is a pretty straightforward one, is you can add us as a friend over Xbox. By doing this, you automatically become a follower in the new Xbox One system. This way, if we happen to have a free spot during a custom game, we can invite you. Or if you happen to know that there's a custom game going on, you can go to our name and join our game. So this is going to leave a bit of a more hands-free kind of option. That way you don't actually have to sign up for anything. It's more, we're going to ask you to come in if we need extra people. Or if you happen to see something's getting set up and you want in, you can. So that's definitely going to be one of the more passive methods. So to do that, you can either add myself, Robius5991, uh, H2Acon, Mnemonic, or Demonic89. And then as we're hosting, we can use that follower system to get you guys in the game, or you can use it to get in. Of course, a lot of the time we'll be actually organizing our custom games well in advance. And so the way that we generally go about doing this is by using a great site known as Halo Customs, which I hope that a lot of people are already familiar with. Halo Customs is a brilliant site where you can set up a page for a custom game lobby that you're going to be hosting and people can RSVP to join you and you can essentially get a lobby together that way. This is something that we used a lot in Halo 4 and it's definitely something we're going to be continuing to use throughout the Halo Master Chief Collection lifetime and so if you don't already have an account we'd strongly recommend that you go and set one up. It's really not that complicated and you can get straight into our custom games through that way. So we'll probably be putting up a video sometime soon on how you go about joining up to Halo Customs and from there what we'd recommend that you do is you like the Online Nights page on that site. What will happen then is every time something is posted on that thread you will get an update. What we generally use this for is by putting up a comment saying, oh, you know, this is when we're going to be hosting a lobby. So you'll be updated that way. And it's just a really easy way of knowing when our lobbies are going to be. So you can go and sign up for that and then from there, get involved. For those of you who use Twitter, we'll be using that to announce upcoming lobbies. The plan will be to post a link to the Halo Customs lobby page as we prepare these in advance. And you'll be able to follow that link directly and RSVP to the lobby on Halo Customs. And lastly, when it comes to big events, we're going to be posting videos explaining this. Uh, we actually have a few ideas coming up once again in association with Halo Customs concerning this. Uh, we're not going to reveal too much just yet, but you may be seeing some videos uploaded when it concerns larger events. Other than that, though, these are essentially all the new ways that we are offering you guys to be able to either sign up to our lobbies, get involved if ever we have room, or keep up to date using social media to get updates on whenever the lobbies are coming out. So yeah, all of the above are ways in which you can get involved with our upcoming Halo Custom games for the foreseeable future. We look forward to playing with you guys and interacting more with the Halo community, because you guys really are a brilliant bunch of guys, and we always really enjoy it. So this has been H2Acon, Robius, and Mnemonic. And thank you all for watching.